All right, let's bring in Elena Rusk. And uh, none, of, none of these storms helped out in fire suppression, did they? That's exactly right. There was even more dry lightning strikes, which helped to spark some new fires, and we had gusty winds. As you know, we are heading into Santa Ana wind season, and that helps to fan the flames, unfortunately, for the fires that burn this time of year. So as we take a look outside, you are seeing the sun coming up and mostly cloudy for most of Kern County. 82 here in Bakersfield. That air quality is still pretty bad out there. Unhealthy for sensitive groups. We've had some scattered showers coming through in the overnight hours. We'll continue to see that for the next couple of hours as well. And with that, it crashes into our heat. Some of these isolated showers try to spur up little thunderstorms, but it's not a strong push of an organized line like we had yesterday. Rather isolated thunderstorms like we've seen all this week. And just some of that light rain there past Rosedale at this hour. So as I zoom you all the way out, you can see that this is tropical moisture left over from what was once Lydia that's spinning up into our area. That's why today is still active, even though it's not as harsh as yesterday was. You see future cast for the most part just calls it clouds. I think there's enough action out there to get some showers all the way down to the ground. We're dropping to 102, still hot, still a lot of evaporation going on, so dry lightning is a threat. But then fresh air starts coming in tonight that dips our temperatures down and dries us out. We like that a lot. 96 by tomorrow, lower 90s. Finally below average by Thursday. Current River Valley 90s for you and some afternoon thunderstorms continue the next couple afternoons and then lower 90s with sunshine and drier weather for the end of the week. By Tatchby standards, you're seeing 87 today. Fraser Park 80 and the most action for some thunderstorms there. Please be very careful on the grapevine because we could have heavy rain, small hail, gusty winds, along with sustained winds to about 30 to 45 miles an hour as that fresh air from the west comes in. Thank you, Elena. Yes,